The Ugandan parliament is currently debating the country's anti-homosexuality bill. Now, in its current form, homosexuality can land you a life sentence in prison, but it could also land you the death penalty. We spoke to Kasha Jacqueline, a gay rights activist in Uganda, who knows firsthand what life is like in Uganda as a gay person. What the bill is trying to do is to just make it illegal for me to be who I am, I'm simply saying I'm a lesbian. First of all, you have to always live in fear of the unknown, but the unknown happens to be known now because it could be attacked in the streets. Or of course, there's a lot of uh, verbal abuse, physical attack, thrown out of public places. So the bill is trying to basically distinguish us from the public or from the society. Because for me to simply be who I am, it's going to become illegal. For me even to rent where I'm seated now, my landlord finds out, my landlord, if, if doesn't report me to the authorities, then my landlord will have to face three years in prison. They're proposing a death penalty for simply, in some cases of homosexuality, like aggravated homosexuality, meaning that me and my partner will be committing aggravated homosexuality, which will mean that we are liable for death. Many Ugandans, actually, until the bill was proposed, did not have the hate. But now, you find people on the street and they're saying we should kill them, and you ask them, are we making homosexual? And they say, I've never made homosexual. It's not only affecting homosexuals, it's affecting a wider community because there's going to be a lot of black men. And because if you read the preamble of the bill, it's talking about uh, protecting the traditional family. But now you're telling my brother to report me to police, you're telling my neighbors to report me to police. How is that going to unite the family? Actually, it's just going to make the family even more. Most of these anti gay groups we have here in Uganda have refused to engage with us. Some of them have never even met homosexuals, some of them have just seen us on TV. Some of them have just talked to us on phone, but they cannot even engage. Every time we, we are in the same space, it's because they're so aggressive. I want to be in a safe space. I want to be in a free place. And the only way I can make this place uh, safe for me is to, to do some changes and just to build solidarity to know that we are not alone. That, uh, it's not only Kasha, but I have brothers and sisters out there who are like me. We live like that, in fear, of course, but you cannot... We, we cannot bury our our heads in the sun and, and feel sorry for ourselves. We need, you need to stand up and do something. Can you imagine living in a nation where to not report a gay person to the authorities could land you up to three years in prison? Let us know your thoughts in a comment and we'll see you again next time.